Hello everyone. Today I'm happy to bring you this 2008 Range Rover Sport HSE. Today I'm going to be giving you a full in-depth tour of the Range Rover. We're going to start up, look at the engine, we're going to look at the interior, I'll explain how all the features work. We'll also go around the exterior. So, let's begin. mirrors and windows, full leather door panel as well as wooden accents and land over badging. Adjustable seats So apply the foot brake, power on the car. This Range Rover has 114,310 kilometers on the clock, which is about 64,000 miles. It has a CD radio. Cruise control settings, volume control, you can also change the station. Voice command, you can also connect your phone to the Bluetooth system in this car and answer or cancel the call. We click mode, it's telling me there's no CD in the CD player. Climate control. Two cup holders. Cigarette lighter and ashtray. This Range Rover has a six speed automatic transmission. So I apply the foot brake, push on this little button, and at the moment we're in park, reverse, neutral, and drive, manual shift. Also, it's this parking brake, and different off road settings. You can choose what kind of terrain you're on. This here is to help the Range Rover climb up steep descents. Many different off road settings. Deep storage area. Has a full leather interior. Very comfortable and supportive seats. Also has these armrests, which two are leather, as well as the armrest here. Also has this very nice wood feature, the Land Rover. Low very much to blend their SUVs. Top glove box. And bottom. And the mirrors. storage shelf there. Let's power off the radio and take a look at the back seats. Electric windows. Leather and wood back here as well. Aluminium door handles, storage pockets, 
beautiful leather rear seats. Storage pockets in the back of the front seats. Maybe a little dark back here. Let's see if we can find any. Here we go. That's some interior lighting. Make it a little brighter. Adjustable headrests. You probably can't see it very well, but there's a 12 volt power outlet in there. As well as adjustable vents. As you'd imagine in this Range Rover, there is loads of room. Lots of legroom and headroom. So we'll get back into the front. So let's turn on the hazards. As the headlights, I like for the fog lights, it does have automatic lights too, and full electric windows. Let's take a look around the exterior. As I mentioned, it is metallic grey in colour. Seventeen-inch alloy wheels front and rear mud guards. Rear parking sensors. Also has an integrated third brake light on a small spoiler. There's a split ticket. If you want to open the whole thing, push that button and pull up. Loads of cargo space. Twelve volt power left and a cargo cover. has lightly tinted windows but because I have the brightness set up on my camera they might they might not look tinted power seats on the passenger side as well on this side as well. Small storage shelf. Very spacious car. Lots of legroom. High intensity discharge headlamps.
mentioned in this Range Rover is a 2.8 litre V6 diesel. Produces 188 brake horsepower. Goes on to the top speed of 120 miles per hour. Produces 324 torques and can average 28 miles to the gallon. Washers. So let's see how the Range Rover sounds. Rest to about 2,500 RPM. Leather wrapped steering wheel. like to say about the Range Rover. To begin with, Range Rover is one of the best 4x4s you can buy these days. It's extremely good at off-road. It has, as you've seen earlier, all the different things you could want for snow, dirt, whatever you could be driving over. Uh, this one comes fully loaded as well with the cruise control, Bluetooth connectivity, CD radio, voice commands, the lot is everything. It has a very nice uh, six-speed automatic gearbox. Uh, shifts are gear shifts are very smooth, and uh, the engine I notice actually sounds very quiet. I was expecting the engine and this to be very loud when I opened the bonnet earlier, but uh, it's actually a lot more quiet than you'd expect. Uh, other things, I love this leather and wood trim Land Rover put in their cars. It's a really nice touch and gives it, it's a really nice uh, feel to the car. You know, it feels more. Um, cozy if, if that's the word you like to use, makes it more comfortable. Um, other things, practicality, well obviously, uh, as I was showing here and there, it has loads of rear leg room, has an excellent size boot, you know, it, it kind of ticks all the boxes when practicality is concerned. And average is about 29 to 31 miles to the gallon, it's telling me up here in the gauge that it can do 31 miles to the gallon anyway. But um, yeah, I think that's all I wanted to say, so um, I hope you enjoyed this review. So we'll finish it up now. See there it says, let's just zoom in, 31.1 mpg. Let's power it off. Well everyone, I hope you enjoyed this full in-depth tour of the 2008 Range Rover Sport. Remember to rate, comment and subscribe, and please stay tuned, there will be plenty more videos to come. Thanks everyone.